Good morning, team. I hope you're all having a great, if not slightly shorter weekend. Man, hasn't the weather we've had recently just been fantastic? The sunshine just makes everything seem so much warmer and brighter and happier. And uh, God's really blessed us this week with a lot of sunshine the last couple weeks. So it's, it's just been a great few weeks. And I just want to say thank you for all you do. I know this COVID stress is very real. I know it's very real for all of you. Um, I know that a lot of you are juggling many things. And I just so much appreciate the dedication that you've shown and, and the dedication you have for our team, uh, for your fellow team members, and for our patients. So thank you all for all that you do. I really, truly mean that. You know, I, I got to admit, I'm going to open up to you guys. I've struggled. Uh, the last few months, um, maybe the last four or five months, this COVID thing has just hit me hard too. And it's difficult for me to be the cheerleader sometimes, but I've fallen down and I have not been the cheerleader I should have been, but I'm working on it. Um, so I'm working with coaches and counselors to try to figure out what's going on and how to rekindle my love for everything that we do because I truly do true I do truly love helping patients and taking care of patients I do truly love all of you um, I just don't show it as much as I should and I'm gonna work on that you have my promise on that um, I'm gonna fall down again so please remind me and lift me up when I fall down and uh, I'll do the same for you but I really do appreciate you all. I, I, I just am so thankful to have all of you on the team and look forward to where this journey takes us. All right, so a few updates for this week. Uh, we don't have a meeting on Tuesday. In lieu of a meeting, if you have something that you want discussed, uh, please take it to your team lead or bring it to me, and we will um, we will talk about it and get it addressed. Uh, I'll look through the suggestion box winners and um, the uh, cumulative card winners and we'll make sure that you are recognized in the appropriate way. And I'll uh, publish suggestions probably uh, by email. So, all right. Uh, this week is our first week without Brandy. It's going to seem like she's on vacation, uh, but then reality is going to set in and we're going to have to figure out the out front department. Um, I have some really good candidates who have degrees in nutrition who are going to come in for interviews. I don't know where that's going to lead because one's coming from near St. Joseph. She said she doesn't mind an hour 15 commute. Um, but in the winter, that hour 15 commute gets really long. So, okay. But anyway, there's, there's hope on the horizon for everything. And uh, gosh, I don't know what else to say. Uh, no COVID vaccine again this week. Uh, CDC cancel our order, and just a heads up, I'm still getting notifications that people are sending in their appointments. I thought I blocked them all off, um, and we should not be appearing on the vaccinefinder.org website uh, because that's run by the CDC, and the CDC is the one canceling our, our order. So it seems like there's a small window between the time when they cancel our order um, it, that, that we appear on that website and people are really taking advantage of that. So I'm trying to notify people beforehand, but if they come in looking for an appointment, um, just apologize and blame the CDC because it truly is the CDC's fault that we are inappropriately flagged on that, on that site. So, all right, until we meet again, may you have many unexpected blessings come your way and may you experience much love, peace, hope, joy, and wellness. All right, everyone, take care.